Widener Pride Football, a team that has had its ups and downs over the years. Going from a record of 3-7 in 2009 to having an undefeated season and claiming the MAC championship over Delaware Valley in 2012, the team definitely speaks for itself as how far they have come. During the season, um, it's pretty much just you get in a routine, wake up, um, we lift in the season as well, and then um, just practice at night from probably like 5 to five to 7, 5 to 8, don't get home until like probably 9 on typical day. The team has an amazing bond. Some may even call it a brotherhood. From practicing, playing, living, studying, or just going to the cafe together, everyone can see it that they have their own special connection. The team bond is, I would say it's phenomenal. You know, we all get along. There's really no, uh, there's no butting heads between the players like in other schools, you know. Everybody really cares about each other. Uh, the team's bond is very strong. Uh, we're basically a big family. I know it sounds cliche, but we really are together. We eat together, we work out together, like we're together all day. I think when Coach Collins came in, he really preached like being with your team and your brothers and it was a brotherhood and like if you're not in a fraternity, this is your fraternity and if you don't have a family, this can be your family. So You start out when freshmen come in, not everyone knows names, but by the end of the season, everyone knows everyone. Um, and I personally live with two other football players. And uh, I mean, I'm constantly around football players all day, so. Everyone's pretty much brothers, always hanging out together. You find one football player somewhere, there's bound to be another one. Um, uh, we've developed a lot of different uh, techniques to accomplish this. Uh, we did have a, a, a team bowling tournament uh, this past Monday. Uh, we did have a dodgeball tournament. We spend a lot of time with our team. It's a tight team. Uh, we had a situation the other day that uh, we had a, a student athlete late for a meeting. And I asked the students, uh, who was late? And they all stood up. Uh, and it was a powerful moment because you could understand the, the bond within the team. I think the stronger the bond, the stronger uh, the opportunity we have to be successful here in the future. Getting wins is definitely important to the teams and coaches. However, being a D3 school, education comes first here at Weiner University. The first thing that I stress is that uh, uh, they need to get to class every day. Uh, that's half of the battle. They get to class, I think, sitting down in their seat, uh, they're going to get a seat. Uh, if they engage in the lesson and build a, a positive relationship with the professors, that's where your good grades come from. While players manage to keep up with their grades, they also manage to keep up with their activities and social groups on campus. One player, current sophomore criminal justice major, Kayshawn Barnes, has the role of being president of Black Men United. This just shows one example of many players that are well involved in organizations around Widener's campus as members and as student leaders. Um, aside from football, I'm also involved in the uh, Presidential Service Corps, Bonner uh, Foundation, which is um, we do 300 hours of community service a year. University. I'm also part of the County Honor Society, and I participate in intramurals. I'm part of the Pride Mentoring Program, and I'm in the Black Student Union. One of the biggest things Widener is known for is its civic engagement with the community. The Pride football team strives to also give back as much as possible. From being role models at Stetzer Elementary to helping clean up the free public library in Philadelphia, the team really does its best to stay involved with the surrounding populace. So we would just walk around Sun Hill and a team and we would break up into little smaller units, pick up a lot of the trash, and walk all through Sun Hill and Ridley, 14, 15 Street, Washington, and uh, just pick up trash and then throw it out. A lot of I participated in the Pride Run, and basically it was like a field day for the children in Chester, the Chester schools, and um, I felt great about it in the end, you know, it felt great to give back to the kids. The Widener football program is not just here to develop skillful athletes. The program helps players grow from young men to hardworking, educated adults, and establishes a lifelong connection with coaches and teammates. Um, the football team has helped me grow as a person by really becoming a better man, knowing when to do my work, and also knowing when to enjoy myself. I learned to deal with a lot of people from a lot of different walks of life, and that was one thing like, that's a real change from high school. You know, you go to high school and it's the people you grew up with, you kinda, kinda know their backgrounds, but when you come to college, it's, it's brand new. It's a new atmosphere. And 
the team has helped me grow tremendously. Um, my leadership skills, my hard work, which has grown a lot. I mean, when I first came here, I had a different perception of hard work. I thought different things were considered hard work and just doing more than the next person. But I found out that you would have to go far and beyond if you really want to be successful. Off the field, I've grown as an individual, I guess, in my character. Um, I've become more of a man, become more independent as an individual, not relying on my parents to do everything for me. The Widener Pride football team offers a way to be a successful athlete and student. The players can always be a constant reminder to all that you don't have to be one or the other in college. Athletes can have the championship, still have the 4.0 GPA, and also maintain a fairly good social standing with fellow students and friends. Some tips for you when coming to Wider University. One, you gotta always attend class. Yeah, the biggest thing is work hard and manage your time. Uh, don't be afraid to reach out right away. You need to prove yourself regardless of what it is. Just take your academic seriously because the coaches are going to. Widener Pride football team, it's more than just a sport. It's unbelievable. Brotherhood. A pack. Phenomenal. Their team, basically your new family, become the college. Wow.